eclipse coverage. One group of elementary school students experiences the historic event and they get a break from the classroom. Yeah, it was all about immersive learning for the second graders. KATV News Watch 7's Eddie Messel has a story. Second graders at Carter Lake Elementary took to the playground to watch today's solar eclipse. Solar eclipses are re rarely happen and they're really quite a sight. Quite a sight is right, so it's only right you celebrate as such. A day filled with learning and donuts. Is the moon and then the white is the sun and then the white sprinkles are the stars. It's a day of partial darkness that these second graders have been waiting for now for over five months. It happened back in 2017, but they were only one or two years old. Oh, and one of my students had said, can you Google to find out when the next one is? So they've actually been looking forward to this now since November. So yeah, so it's really cool that we were able to come out. It's a school day and they can experience it together. Donuts weren't the only fun project of the day. Students also decorated their own special glasses to make sure they didn't miss a moment of the moon passing over the sun. It looks really cool to see that um, the moon cover up the sun at like when and we get to see it happen when it takes place. Teachers always look for creative ways to make school and learning fun. Today's solar eclipse did just that, making math and science a little more enjoyable. Right now we're all in a geometry unit and so being able to relate you know that to the what they're learning now has um, been a good connection and correlation for them and they're very excited about about talking about the fractions and how much of the sun is going to be covered up. Because it's 80% of the earth is going to get covered. Yes it is. Miss Arndt also joined in on the fun wearing a costume to help the students understand the science behind a solar eclipse. Well, just having a visual for the kids is always fun. The kids have really been having a lot of fun. Um, they've been moving the moon around to match the, the actual uh, eclipse right now. Reporting from Carter Lake Elementary, Eddie Messel, KETV Newswatch 7.